What's going on Fallen Family? Today I had something very special planned for us. I had all three Pokemon Go Team collection boxes and the plan was to do a box versus box versus box to see which team would come out on top. I'm going to let you know right now Team Valor did end up winning. However, most of my video footage got corrupted so I can only really show you a couple of pulls. That will be towards the end of the video. Instead, today we're going to do an unboxing of an Astral Radiance Elite Trainer box. Let's jump right on into it. Alright guys, so let's get started on into this. Um, like I said, I, I did have those Pokemon Go team boxes for you guys. However, like the the quick time player, the me like the media part of it just kept pausing randomly, so I don't know exactly how much of the footage was actually lost. Um, and what was recorded and what was not. So instead, I'm going to go ahead and do this uh, Astral Radiance Elite Trainer Box opening for you guys. Let's go. Uh, Astral Radiance, is, compared to Pokemon Go, is a much bigger set. Um, and because it is an Elite Trainer Box, it is going to come with you know the player's guide. It's going to give you some tips. It's also going to give you all the cards that are going to be in this set. Um, you know, I can flip through each one for you guys if you want. Typically, I just like to go straight for, like, the hyper, hyper rares, the rainbow rares. Because those are, like, considered... Most of them are considered, like, uh, chase cards or even the alternate artworks. Here, I the most valuable one in this set as of, like, right now is going to be this right here. This alternate artwork from a champ. And he's just rolling through the city, handing out... Look like he got a bunch of bowls, melons. Looks like he's working working for some sort of store but um yeah so that, that's kind of the main one we want to pull but of course any of these any of the the hyper rainbow rare ones um, I'll take even the the golden ones golden ones are pretty cool as well um but yeah so we'll jump right on into it like I said because it is the elite trainer box all right I'll take this on out it is gonna come with with that own set of sleeves, the dark rice sleeves. Well, you should get 10 packs, unless I change it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, only eight packs. Okay. And then uh, some energies and a bunch of other fun stuff for playing the game. Um, and you know what? We will use the sleeves for anything that we will get here today. We'll use the sleeves. Let's see if we got all the artwork. So you have the Palkia, the Dekidai, the Hisuian, Typhlosion, the Samurott, and the Dialga. Now personally, personally, um, out of these, artwork wise, uh, I just give it to the Dialga. I don't know. There's or the Palkia. Um, the Dialga is nice, but I, I feel like the, the Pakia's colors just pop more. Um, but we'll go ahead and we'll start opening opening them up. So originally in that video I had thought I recorded, it literally took like four different times because it just kept happening. Um, I kind of went in depth because I realized I didn't do it on that first video. Here's a little code card for you guys ab about what this channel is going to be hopefully um, you know why I started it fighting energy uh, cranny dose feather ball whiskash ralts hisuian sneasel mischievous barboach pawnyard Ooh! so in here I did forget to mention there's also like a subset it's the trainer gallery you'll see it there that little TG right there so um there's like a, a little subset within the set. That's nice. We'll sleep those. We'll always sleep those. And a non hollow of a Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll always leave anything that looks like the full art right there. That's nice. Go ahead and put that right there. So, yeah, so I kind of talked about what this, you know, why I started this channel. And it's just to pretty much, hopefully, I can inspire other people to chase any of their dreams and show them that it's really not too late and just starting it can help you out so much um, like I said uh, in the first the first video opening 
uh, Pokemon packs, you know, Dragon Ball Super packs. Those those have always been some sort of like a nice little hobby, a stress reliever for me. It gives me some downtime, dark energy. Perugly, Azelf, Switch Cart, Drifloon, Sudowoodo, Magnemite, Ralts, Hisuian, Sneasel, uh, Regalecki, Regalec yeah, maybe I'm saying that right. Uh, Reverse Hollow, and a Lucario V. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Um, but yeah, it's always been some sort of like stress reliever for me. Just as give me a break um, from time to time. And I just want to show people that doing something you enjoy and. I didn't get that. Oh, my Siri is bugging. Just doing something you enjoy is, um. It's always good. It's always good to have something that you enjoy. It gives you a break, you know? It gives you a, a little escape, if you will. Um, lightning Energy, Trekking, Gold Duck, Grant, Puchiana, Swinub, Hisuian Quillfish, Petalil, Nicket, Reverse Hollow, and the back to back Nicket, and a non hollow Bravery. Bravery. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so this channel, hopefully, um, I want to just keep it a variety channel. Um, hopefully it stays that way. I, I plan on doing it a variety channel. Just a mix between, you know, opening Pokemon cards and Dragon Ball Super cards. And, you know, One Piece has a, a little set coming out soon. I know it dropped in Japan, but, um, you know, if I can get it my hands on that and uh, I'll definitely try to just take a look into that I'm, I'm big on anime as well I, I love anime but this channel uh, is just gonna be card openings super effective glasses runs on and um, hopefully some video game maybe uh, like some let's play a couple live streams a walkthrough perhaps but I'm, I'm pretty much into most video games uh, non hollow or reverse hollow Reggie rock and a non hollow memo swine um, I'm, I'm really big into video games, preferably like RPGs or JRPGs, uh, tend to be my favorite, um, just cause it's something I can just like lay back on the couch or in the gaming chair and just enjoy and, you know, progress the story, help build my character, um, but by far my all time favorite, um, is, game is just gonna be Persona 5. I was... Never, I uh, never played any of the Personas before. Uh, I decided to jump into Persona 5 when I got my PlayStation 4. Because I've always had an Xbox. But I just fell in love with the game. And ever since then, it's just been Persona 5 everything, man. Uh, Scyther, Reverse Hollow, Magneton, and a Heat Ran V. It's not, not a bad, not bad artwork there. Well, we're really not getting too many pulls from this box here. Oof. And it, it does look like this, this video is going to be kind of a short one just because, you know, with the unexpected malfunctions is what I, I'll call them. Um, you know, this is just something that was just put together really quickly. Uh, Yuxi, Hisuian, uh, Overquill, Kamado, Mischievous, Barboach, Scyther. I might even do a, um, I know Pokemon Scarlet and Violet is coming out. I already have it pre-ordered. Um, maybe like a little Let's Play with that and sort of like an interactive sort of Let's Play where, you know, you guys help, help me along my journey in that game and we can build like the best Pokemon team ever for that game. I'm really surprised I'm doing so well with these packs because, as you saw in the last video, I did use the scissors for some of them, but I have no problems right now. So not too bad. Not too bad. We're really not getting a lot. Fire Energy, Jubilife, Dartrix, Driflim, Teddy Ursa, Mantine, Hisuian Voltorb, a Basculin, Glameow, a Reverse Hollow Eevee, and look at that! We got a Rainbow Rare Hisuian Typhlosion V-Star. Let's go! That's nice. Just as I was talking about how we weren't getting nothing. We're going to see this up. 
Oh, man, Astral Radiance just came to shut me up. That's not bad. We'll take that. A Trainer Gallery card and a Rainbow Rare. Let's go. I'll take that any day. Any day. It's not bad. Not bad at all. So, last pack. Hopefully, we get something even better for last pack magic. I typically don't get last pack magic, though. Here's a code card for you guys. We go one, two, three, four... All right, let's 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 see if we can guess this last one and, and maybe we get something. We're going to go Fighting Energy. Oh, Psychic. A Duat, a Yen Mega, a Selene, Combi, Drifloon, Psyduck, Togepi, Magnetite. Oh, let's go! Let's go! Look at that artwork. Wow, that's nice. I have not pulled one of these yet. Let's go! And a hollow Absol, which kind of just gets overshadowed. Let's go. Calyrex VMAX, let's go. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve this up. Look at that, man. So not too bad of a box. Not too bad of a box. I mean, look at these. Look at these three pulls right there. Out of eight packs, that's, that's pretty good. Thank you guys for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, and drop a comment down below. Let me know which card from this set is your favorite. Now, if you want to stick around and watch the pulls from the Pokemon Go boxes, go right on ahead. It's going to be Leaf Energy, Blanche, Ariados, Egg Incubator, Bidoof, Meltan, Charmander, Apom, Bulbasaur, oh, Reverse Hollow Spinarak, but not a Ditto. Oh, and another Mewtwo V-Star. That's that's two back-to-back -back in the video card. An Egg Incubator, Wartortle, Unpheasant, Alolan Rattata, Wimipod, Pikachu, Squirtle, Bidoof. And we got a Ditto. We managed to pull a Ditto. Let's go. Turtle, Unpheasant, Lure Module, Bidoof, Charmander, Apom, Bulbasaur, Bidoof. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Radiant Blast Toys, hey, we got something. I think that takes it. I had a Spinarak, Pikachu, Wimpod, and Conkledor V Ultimate Art. Let's go. I do have this one already, but this is still nice.